Okay, three, two, one, go. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Richard Bartlett here. Hope you're enjoying uh, the ridiculous continuing lockdown for no reason. Um, just wanted to say, I mean, I bet a lot of you have been watching, you know, series on Netflix or whatever. And some of you, of course, are, are boycotting Netflix, and I don't blame you. But I mean, Arrow's on Netflix, and also uh, The Flash. And I'm a big superhero fan. Like I've even got a, I've got a green uh, lantern ring, and I probably would have a Flash ring, but I just haven't bought it. But I love icons like that because the whole Matrix Energetics thing. I was just telling somebody started with me seeing an image of the George Reeves Superman. It wasn't just an image, it was a fully interactive, three-dimensional, holographic life form that I could converse with uh, and, and physically see. So I, I watched a lot of, um, I, I watched all the Superman episodes back in, in the 50s when I was a kid. And I've always loved Superman, absolutely loved Batman, because Batman, you know, is me, you know. If you've seen pictures of me in the bat outfit, the Michael Keaton bat outfit. But it's amazing how you can take these iconic heroes, which which some are trying to get rid of, like they're white superheroes, males, not not okay. Uh, but it's amazing how you can do this and you can learn. And children they need role models. And this is the death of a culture begins when you destroy its art, you destroy its music, you destroy its language. All that is happening. Um, and you can go inside of yourself and you can find the archetype of the hero. Every good story has the hero's journey involved in it, where you go through, you go through an initiation period, you go through tribulation, you come out from that and 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 it looks like a really serious situation and then everything's okay. Well, that doesn't mean that everything's always gonna be okay, but life is a journey and a flow. And whenever we interrupt the flow by being too invested in the journey, then we have a chapter in the story that we're kind of stuck in. Now, sometimes it's great to be stuck in a story because if the story is wonderful or if it's really exciting or really terrifying, there's there's entertainment. It's got entertainment value. That's why we like these various types of things. Uh, me, I'm I'm pretty much into the superhero thing. So um, go with your heroes. Um, notice your villains, and notice that it's all a holographic archetype, and it's just life unfolding. I'll see you next week.